Just revealed today is brand new gameplay of Grand Theft Auto 6 officially, alongside a new inside leak relating to an official announcement from GTA 6 you guys won't want to miss, and I'll be covering it here today. Even though GTA 6 is expected to launch next year according to a leak on an Xbox document, you guys just received this new teaser from Michael himself being a main character here inside of Grand Theft Auto 5 you guys must see first. It's Ned Luke, aka Michael DeSantis. Grand Theft Auto 5. All right, so we just crossed the threshold of 10 years, right? 10 freaking years of Grand Theft Auto 5. I just want to give a big shout out to the fans because we all know hashtag the fans are the game. So thanks a lot. 10 years. Keep playing. And only what? Maybe five years of those? Or where the fuck is GTA 6? Patience, guys. It'll be worth the wait. Trust me. Five was worth the wait. Six is going to be even more worth the wait. So keep playing five. Have fun. And remember, you forget a thousand things every day. How about you make sure this is one of them? And stop firing rockets at my house. Happy 10. So Michael has essentially teased the release of Grand Theft Auto 6, and here's what just released today, and which you guys can see. According to a new inside leak, GTA 6 must be revealed on October 26, according to a new insider. And which you guys can now see, Rockstar Games has rumored to announce GTA 6 on October 26, and one self-styled insider, Chris Marks, known by his online handle, is now confirming that Grand Theft Auto 6 announcement is set to release on the 26th of October, 2023, which Chris isn't a new player in the leaking game, as his tracking record is pretty good, and he's also had announcements related to games like Payday 3 and Dragon Dong Ma 2 coming true. So this obviously does raise a lot of concerns, and it looks to be that this is going to be a massive date, considering it's even been in the past where GTA and also Red Dead Redemption were announced in the late months of October. So let me know your guys' thoughts on that, because I think that's extremely interesting. The chances are high that Rockstar will now be adding iconic Miami buildings to Grand Theft Auto 6 and what you guys can see this would be a great fit considering it's been leaked already that Miami is going to be a main city here inside of Grand Theft Auto 6 now on top of that you guys can see that they love Vice City and a lot of people can't wait for Grand Theft Auto 6 so based on new leaked gameplay from the actual beach you guys can actually see that this is what it looks like here inside of Vice City as well so it almost looks to be some sort of like remastered variant of what we could expect here inside of GTA 6, which GTA 6 will reportedly bring back the iconic chainsaw from Vice City as a melee weapon, according to a former Rockstar employee. So this is going to be extremely cool, considering it looks to be that they're doing a lot of things and bringing back a lot of unique things from prior Grand Theft Auto games, which I feel like will definitely bring back a lot of the older players and also obviously a ton of newer players kind of getting to experience the old vibes of other Grand Theft Autos. And speaking of the old other times GTA 6 is rumored to include a period of time where a player will play in the 1970s to 1980s era for a period of time before living in a modern era similar to Grand Theft Auto 5 so it looks to me that this may even be something like the beginning storyline of what we can expect here inside of the campaign side of Grand Theft Auto 6 and this would be definitely a really interesting thing they could be adding to the game considering that Michael and Franklin have already revealed themselves a brand new teaser I personally now believe that Trevor is going to have a main announcement very soon in the upcoming days, considering the elite did reference to October 26 being the official date that Grand Theft Auto will now be releasing like an official teaser trailer potentially for the official release date of GTA 6, maybe even sometime in April or possibly even sometime in the beginning of the summer. Considering if you guys didn't actually know, the official date of GTA 5 when it was first initially supposed to release was the springtime of actually 2012 so that is going to be something interesting that i think that they could potentially do and try to aim towards something like that which obviously later on did then get delayed until september so this is going to be something i cannot wait for and it's going to be a crazy month here inside of the grand theft auto community in addition to that here's an actual gta 6 teaser trailer concept that i want to make sure you guys can actually see for yourself because i think this is really cool considering gta 6 is right around the corner so this is what we could kind of expect on october 26th leading into the actual official reveal so here's what you guys can check out
So let me know your guys' thoughts on that official concept trailer related to Grand Theft Auto 6. And considering there's more evidence to GTA 6 launching in 2024, Rockstar Publisher is expected to earn a massive revenue, revenue of $8 billion next year, which the only way that could be possible is with a game like GTA. So it's pretty much 100% or 99.9% .9 confirmed that GTA 6 official reveal is going to be at the end of 2023 being in October and the official date and when it's going to be launched is 2024. So ladies and gentlemen, the time is finally here. And let me tell you guys, I cannot wait. It's going to be such a great time here inside of Grand Theft Auto's community. And I'm going to be so excited to play it and get into a new game that I think is very deserving of coming out as of now. Considering we've waited so long for this since the release of GTA 5, it's finally time where we can enjoy a new Grand Theft Auto. And I'm so excited for that. And bringing back this extremely interesting chart, you guys can actually see that Grand Theft Auto was teased on October 25th, 2011, and the trailer was that was then released just about a week later, you guys. So that's pretty interesting to say the least. Alongside, you guys can see that GTA 6 is most likely going to be getting themselves the reveal at the end of October, and then probably sometime in the beginning of November is when we can expect an actual official trailer of Grand Theft Auto 6. And it's crazy to even say that that's even the possibility considering it's just been so long it doesn't even seem real at this point but obviously we all know it is real and it is now finally coming into the game so make sure you guys drop a like and are subscribed to gta central because we're going to be keeping you guys posted leading into grand theft auto 6 and this is just one of the best times to be a grand theft auto fan without a doubt thank you all so much for watching i hope you guys did definitely enjoy today's video and if you did drop a like comment down below what day you guys think it will come out and predict your predictions relating to what the day could could possibly be for yourselves related to the trailer because we kind of already know the announcement will be the 26th but let me know when you guys think the trailer could actually come out what day in november or possibly even maybe on october who knows let me know down in the comments below drop a like subscribe and i'll catch you guys on a further gta central video take care everyone have a great rest of your day and i'll catch you guys on the very next video peace out have a good one